Hey hockey fans, welcome back to the Oilers Fanatic. Mark Spector of Sportsnet broke the news today. The Edmonton Oilers have signed defenseman Slater Cuckoo to a two-year deal with an AAV of $925,000. Here's the official press release from the Oilers. Cuckoo, 27, appeared in 18 games with the Oilers during the 2020-2021 season, scoring one goal. He also dressed for all four playoff games, notching an assist and averaging 12.27 in ice time. Joining the Oilers in December as a free agent, the Winchester, Ontario native was originally Tampa Bay's first-round selection, 10th overall in the 2012 NHL Draft. The 6'2", 193-pound blue liner has appeared in 167 career NHL games with the Tampa Bay Lightning, Chicago Blackhawks, and Edmonton Oilers registering 8 goals and 22 assists. I'm a little surprised Cuckoo got a 2-year deal, but I don't have a problem with it. It's a 925 k price tag, right where he should be, and he gives the Oilers depth for the next 2 years on the left side, and prospects like William Legison will have to really fight for their ice time, which creates the competition we've always wanted to see. I think this will be the last UFA signing of significance, unless Ken Holland makes a trade that frees up additional cap space. The only trade that I could see doing that is if they move Miko Koskinen. Let's take a look at the Oilers' defensive depth chart following today's signing. In the top pairing, they have Darnell Nurse and Tyson Berry. In the second pairing, they have Duncan Keith and Cody Ceci. And in the third pairing, they have Slater Cuckoo and Evan Bouchard. Chris Russell is the perfect 7th D-man, as he can play on the left or right side for the Oilers, filling in as needed. William Legison, Philip Broberg, and Dmitry Samarukov will challenge for a spot, but with the current depth, I think they will be hard-pressed to make the cut and will likely be in Bakersfield for the year, unless the Oilers run into injury problems. But if injuries do happen, it's nice to know you have guys like that waiting for their chance. That's all for today. What do you guys think of the Cuckoo signing? Sound off in the comments below. Enjoying the videos? Please like and subscribe for all the latest Oilers content. You've been listening to The Fanatic. Thanks for being a fan.